What's going on everyone, Kellen Rec here. A couple of years ago I made a video on clearing caches on your Mac so that you could clear up space on your computer. I just wanted to do a quick update so that I could really streamline this for 2020, 2021, kind of moving forward. It's been a few years, so I wanna make sure that everything is clear. Now, if you look at my computer here, you can see I only have 57 gigs of free space. That's not a lot of space on the computer. So what happens is if you're an Adobe Creative Cloud user and you use applications like After Effects and Adobe Premiere, you're gonna to start to build up a lot of hidden render files, media cache files, and these take up a crazy amount of space on your local hard drive. And that's not something that we necessarily want. It does help speed up editing in some cases, but in general, after a little bit of time, we wanna clear these so that we can make this number bigger. We want more space available on our computer so things run smoother. So what you wanna to do to fix this is you wanna to go to this go button at the top of your screen. And if you hold down the option key or the alt key, you'll see that this hidden library kind of icon appears here. So you'll click on that. That'll bring us to our hidden library folder. Now there's a lot of different folders in here that can show us different things about the computer. However, there's just a few things that we want to clear out. So the first thing you want to do is go to application support, Adobe. Then you want to go down to common. Within common, you have a whole bunch of these media cache files. So the first folder we wanna clear is this media cache folder. And you can basically just command A and select everything within the folder and delete it. So we have almost 500 documents here. We'll delete all of those. Then you go to the media cache files folder, which has almost, or has over 1100 items. You can delete all of these as well. So just command A and we'll delete those. Then you wanna go back to the library folder. We're gonna to go to caches, and then we're gonna look for Adobe. Within Adobe, you can go to your After Effects folder. Within here, here you'll go to your latest version that you're using. That's where most of your disk cache files should be. And you'll go to the disk cache folder, and we can delete all of these folders as well. You can see I'm still at about 57 gigs. If I just clear my trash, you'll see that we're actually gonna end up freeing up a ton of space. You can see we're deleting almost 8,000 files, almost 10,000 files, a crazy amount of space. Now, sometimes when you delete this, it's not gonna show you the updated available space and your computer's gonna take a few minutes to just reanalyze, but you can clear up, I've seen people clear up to two, 300 gigabytes of space just by cleaning out these media cache files. So I hope this helped for you. I hope it worked in your case. Let me know in the comments if it worked for you. We'll check you back in the next one. Thanks a lot, guys. And if you enjoyed the video, go ahead and subscribe and like. Thank you so much.